brief tutorial, you'll find out how to search for customers, sign up a customer for Safe ID, and then identify which customers have Safe ID, uh, which don't, and which need a Safeguard or MySafe account created for them. So each of you will be given a link that will allow you to go to the portal to log in. The login information is going to be your existing username and password for your emails and other company access for the other portals you use and the other platforms you currently uh, access. Once you log in, it's very simple in nature. Again, the entire program has been designed to take 30 seconds or less to sign up a customer. So you'll see this screen in front. Uh, easy to search for any part of a customer account, specifically customer number, name, address, city, state, zip, or email can each be entered into this field to then find that customer and locate if they have safe ID, if they do not, and then how to sign them up. Uh, let's do a test account here really quickly to show you what it looks like if a person has safe ID. So this customer we're going to use is 19236, and we hit search. And you'll notice it processes and up. It gives you all the examples of customers that have any type of matching field there. So a couple of customers down here happen to have the same prefix for the address. But the one we want to use today is Andrew Spencer, customer 19236. Again, the, the easiest part to search is the customer number. And you'll already be in communication with the customer for whatever they called in for originally or what we called them for originally. And so you'll have the screen up for the platform you currently use. You can copy and paste a customer number into this field very easily or an address. And then you just make sure here the name matches the person you're on the phone with. So I'm going to click on Andrew Spencer. Up comes this box that says customer information. Yep, this is the person I'm currently talking to. Down below you'll notice there are two My Safeguard accounts already set up. So now I know, okay, this person has a My Safeguard account. Down here under AB Spencer you'll see there's an ID sign. That means this customer has safe ID, or at least that login customer has it. So we go back out, and let's search a customer that does not have safe ID. And so, I'm sorry, that uh, yeah, does not have safe ID. So on here, uh, you'll notice I gave another example here that shows Jane and Joe test account. These are our two test accounts that I want to walk through and show you guys exactly how to sign a customer up for safe ID. If I first click on Joe test account, you'll notice here, again, My Safeguard accounts. Great, Joe has a My Safeguard account. If I click on that, up comes his information. And, and you'll notice on the right-hand side of the test account, there is no Safe ID logo. So I click on his test account, and up comes uh, all the information to create a Safe ID account. You have all the tools you need right here to sign a customer up and take 30 seconds or less, including a script down below that's very easy to be read. The, the scripting and voice control is in another training. For the purpose of this training, it's just to sign the customer up. So look here, first name, last name. You will request the date of birth for the customer. Very simple to do. Uh, Mr. Test Account, just because we want to make sure your account's linked to you only and your identity is secure. What's your date of birth? Simple as that. Type in the date of birth. Hit Save. It will create that account immediately. Information submitted. An email is sent to Joe test account at safeguard.us. So then the customer logs in. When you're on the phone with the customer, if you've got the chance to do it, have them go to their computer if they're home, make sure they got the email, they can finish the sign-up process in, in less than a minute. Same thing on the other account. We go to Jane test account. Over here it says, no My Safeguard accounts for this customer. Great, no big deal. So on the right-hand side, I'm going to create both a My Safeguard and Safe ID account for this customer. Same information, Jane test account. Uh, Jane, we do want to make sure that this is your information, that your identity is secure. Uh, we're going to link that up to you personally. What's your date of birth? Type in the date of birth. Again, hit save. Information submitted. An email has been sent to. We used uh, my email address in here as an example, but it'll be sent to the customer. And if you're on the phone with the customer, if you don't mind, uh, Miss Test Account, can you just verify real quick and dump online, make sure that you got that? Oh, perfect. Great. If they're not by computer, no big deal. They'll, they'll get that email and finish the sign-up process on their own. So that uh, finalizes the, the training program for the 30-second sign-up. Again, additional information will be coming down the line for training, voice control. Remember, the script is designed that if you are on the phone with any customer for any reason, take that 30 seconds, get them signed up for Safe ID. Thanks and good luck.